Begin right here in Columbia, where the Soda City Comic Con has made its return, bringing thousands of people along with it. It is an event that comes each year, bringing together pop culture fans from across the Midlands. And last year, event organizers say around 6,000 people came out dressed in their favorite game and movie characters. But this year, expecting an even larger turnout, and businesses are hoping for a boost. A boost News 19's Walker Lawson tells us more about. Thousands of people lined up at the Columbia Metropolitan Convention Center for the return of Comic-Con. Full of energy and excitement, Nicholas Williams is one of the many who came out in their finest costumes. I'm dressed up as a scout from Attack on Titan, one of the uh, best animes out at the time. As those dressed up filled the building with their lightsaber tricks and Batman style outfits, Donald Brock Jr. co-founder is happy to see all the people in attendance this year. Made it last year. I believe uh, around $700,000, and that would have been a depressed, uh, depressed show. I would expect this year, given the crowd, given everybody's enthusiasm, yeah. uh, wanting to get back outside, wanting to come to events, that we would uh, exceed that number. As last year's show, which welcomed around 6,000 people, is projected to be beaten out this year with an expected 8,000 people in attendance, which is a plus for businesses in the area like Sweetwater Coffee and Tea, which is located one block over from the convention center and has seen quite the business. We've seen a, a decent amount of people here, uh, more than a usual Saturday. Pretty interesting. I get to meet people dressed as all different characters. I've seen some superheroes, um, Kim Possible, the Super Mario Brothers came. Um, it definitely, I mean, helps business. Maddie Tomasic at Sweetwater says as Saturday's been busy, the shop is excited to see what the second day of Comic-Con brings. I, I have a feeling it will be. It's been really busy today. Brock Jr. says if you want to attend Sunday's show, you still have time for the fun events. Tournament, which is a women's only tournament in pinball. Um, all our celebrity guests will still be here with the exception of Mr. Paul. The same stuff, different panels, you know, just same vendors. In Columbia, I'm Walker Lawson, News 19 WLTX.